the group number one. Uh, actually, we all, actually it is not a preaching like, but all gave a beautiful ideas that uh, we concentrate on that uh, holy mass, no? Actually, as we have read this, uh, every day we are going for holy mass, but it is according to our schedule. Uh, one table is there in the seminary, morning 6.30, there will be holy mass, that's where all are going. But uh, you know, during holidays, we are going to home. I think all will not go every day, the holy mass, because it is uh, up to us, uh, optional. So sometimes our mother will call, go for mass, so either they will tell us, but it is not sure that all have to go for the mass every day. But in a seminary, it is a, there is a particular table that say all will go. So we have to change that particular idea from our, that concept uh, and we give importance to the holy mass and without prayer life we can't do anything sharing <laughs> and uh, they all gave many many ideas like uh, mm. and also but Nirmal said, uh, uh, regarding our vocation, uh, our vocation is not up to us, but uh, we can form our vocation through our daily prayer life. Uh, but if you are thinking that I, we don't have uh, vocation, like that if you are thinking that uh, we cannot go forward. But if we think that we have vocation, that's why God called us here. So, um, every day we have to prepare for our vocation. Uh, that is a, uh, by without the help, without the help of uh, prayer, we can't do anything. So, I want, I want to tell our group, we all discussed about the prayer life. Without the prayer life, we can't do anything.